The material that goes from the stomach to the small intestine is known as chyme. Chyme contains food that has been partly digested, as well as stomach acid, so it's very acidic and must be neutralized. Bile is produced in the liver and stored in the gallbladder before being released into the small intestine at a section called the duodenum, where it mixes with chyme. It has two main functions, neutralization and emulsification. Bile is alkaline, meaning it has a high pH, and so it neutralizes the excess stomach acid, raising its pH. This is important because the enzymes in the small intestine cannot function in acidic conditions. It's a good time here to recap enzymes. These are proteins that help speed up chemical reactions in living organisms. In the case of digestion, they speed up the breakdown of large food molecules into smaller ones. For example, there are enzymes that speed up the breakdown of lipid molecules into fatty acids and glycerol. The second job of bile is emulsification. Bile emulsifies lipids. This means it takes large lipid globules and breaks them down into smaller droplets. This provides a larger surface area for enzymes to work. What does that mean? Well, picture a single large globule of lipid with a volume of one centimeter cubed. I'll spare you the maths and tell you that the total area of its surface would be about 4.8 centimeters squared. Now imagine we split that volume in half. So we have two spheres, each with a volume of 0.5 centimeters cubed, but still totaling one centimeter cubed. If we calculate the surface area of each of these, we'd find it's about 3 cm squared each, giving a total surface area of around 6 cm squared. So if we split large lipid globules into many smaller ones, we provide more area for enzymes to break down lipids, speeding up digestion. Just to recap, Bile neutralizes excess stomach acid and it emulsifies lipids to increase the surface area for enzymes to work. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. With Science Source, I like to explain ideas as simply and in as little time as possible. If that's something you would find useful, you might want to subscribe.